Hey guys, it's Ari and Ethan. We're Hello. live. What's going on? Um, we're here for uh, the testimony challenge. We're so excited. I don't know what day, what day is it? Today's the 8th. No, like right. the day of the testimony challenge. What <laughs> day? No, like day 6, 7. Eight, eight. It's all oh, it's day. Sorry. It's day. No, oh, it's the 8th. Sorry, guys. So, we're doing the testimony challenge. <laughs> church how I'm a big part in the church and how I help out and volunteer and she just kind of stopped everything and pointed she was like that is where it's from that's where it comes from that is where your peace your calmness and your confidence comes from and you know that's just really encouraging to hear because my entire life my parents have always prayed over me that I would be a light to those who need a light that I would always be there for people and I've never heard anyone just say that's where it's from or just point out blatantly what it is. I know some people just come to me and ask for life advice because they see a light around me. And that is nothing but God. And yeah. And just to add on to Nathan's story, like this wasn't him just talking to someone. Like this was a person interviewing him. And it was just amazing. And I have, from where I work, um, this woman came in and she was like, she was really, really nice. We were having, we were actually having a really fun conversation. And she was, she was looking, I work at a furniture store, she was looking for a couch specifically, because I remember she burst into tears and was like, God sent me here. She was like, I just got out of a really hard time in my life and I just got into a one bedroom apartment and I've been working towards this and I'm really happy and this is the couch I want. And I was like, that is amazing. And then she looked at me and she started crying even more. And she was like, you just have the presence of God. Like, you just have this presence about you. And it just makes me happy. And it makes me want to pray. And she grabbed my hands and she just said, can we just pray? And so I literally, I got to pray for her for like 10 to 15 minutes. And I got to prophesy over her. And it was so fun. And props to Bobby Morrison. He gave us this uh, verse. And it's 2 Corinthians uh, 2.15. It's, we have become the unmistakable aroma of the victory of the anointed one to God, a perfume of life to those being saved. And it's just, like, God wants to work through us. Like, that laughing fit earlier, it's just, like, that is how good God is. Like, we were, we were kind of nervous to come yeah. on, and then, like, we just, like, I could not stop laughing. And God is just so good, and like He wants, like, I being being a light to people isn't going up to them and go, "Can I pray for you?" Like it it is, but also it, it can literally be telling someone a joke. It could be complimenting someone's outfit. It could say, "Hey, you looking real good today." Like it's just it's these simple things. Like it doesn't have to be this. It's going in for an interview. It's working at your job. It's doing all these things. And so I think Nathan and I just really want to pray over you guys that it's not this big pressure thing of, oh, I I must show the light. Like, it's like when God is in you, the light isn't hard to shine. It's not this, it's not going to be these like 
pulls it's and the can. No, it's not something that you have to like turn on and off. And you can't hide going. it either. And there's no way to hide it. It, it, it pierces through everything that you have going on. And I mean, just in so many different instances, I know me and Ari both have had times where people just come up to us and people that we hardly even know or don't even know at all and just like just ask us life questions and I mean we, we help them to the best we can but it's just that light that have that that, that, they, that they trust and I know I've met people in my life where I just I, I don't physically see a light but I know that there's a light there and it's the people that have that calmness that that, that confidence of, of God with them yeah so we're just gonna pray for you guys we're just gonna do you want to start or end can you also pray too, just for the joy of the Lord? Yeah. To call on this yeah. Watching. <laughs> so. Girl, you made me laugh again. <laughs> so, Lord, we just thank you for an amazing day, for amazing testimonies, and that we just right now will declare that the light of God will start shining through people, and that people will start noticing the light of God shining through, even in the most difficult of circumstances. And that we pray for the joy of the Lord to enter <laughs> homes. And that if you're watching this live, that spontaneous laughter, <laughs> uncontrollable laughter. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, sorry. I'm, not, I'm actually not sorry at all. Like I, I'm going to interrupt all of y'all's speed, and just y'all gonna see me wheezing. <laughs>